we thank God for another day. Amen. I bring you heavenly greetings in Jesus' name. Amen. I am still talking about the ability to see. Yet da nyamia si e wo da fufroi enso. Me di heaven in chia brow e wo yesu di mo. Amen. Me guswa e kasafa di ebe to me amu wo huna di e ye e hon. Let's hear the heavens report for today. My foundation is strong and no one can destroy it. Mm-hmm. My enemies try to destroy it, but they don't succeed because no one can destroy what I lay down. Therefore, if you are wise, build on my foundation. And don't waste your time to try to destroy it because you won't succeed. Mm-hmm. Thus says the Lord. Amen. This is Pastor Dr. Kukudazi reporting live from heaven. Yinti ene heaven amani bono. Mi fapim ye ding. Na obiara into me and say no. Matamfu a bow on whom modin se or besaino Nansuso won't to me. A son say, Dear Medi etuhon, or bea and to me and saino. A nunti sa we in yan senior to me me fapem no so. Na men say wa die ye, name bow whom modin se or besaino. A son say, Won't to me and saino. Said ye a radi siene. We your sofu, Dr. Kukudazi, Mamani Boa, midi free heaven. Amen. I was saying last week that if God says something is an abomination, it's something you should never think about, let alone do it. Because such indulgence attracts God's heavy punishment. Na me kan na wotwe twa mu no se se nyankopon ka se adie bi ye ebusude a enwene ho da na kan pese wakoye e san se se wakoye a e di nyankopon asutwe a e din pa beba oso but sadly some people allow themselves to be induced by demons to do abominable things Na rahu seven is a nipper binum jai wong, madam money can one so, and my way a busudier. That was how Judas allowed himself to be used by demons to betray the Holy Lord Jesus Christ. Sir, and a Judas man who coin, and my adam money a farness so, now o ye a radi yesu Christa. And as Judas later saw what he had done and went to hang himself, never think of disregarding God's warning to do what you like. Na said ye tree, Judas huni oye na oko shen huwa konfono. Men wini da se ube pu nyanku pon sem. Na why they open? If you don't like God and you want to do abominable things, do away with all his laws and don't use any in your life or in your country. Say umpe nyame ne se upe se uye abusudi edia eni etu ne mran semi na agu na mem febia nyejuma au abrabum anase. Mama na mamu. You can't disagree with God's law against homosexuality and use his other laws that benefit you in your countries. Muntumi and Kase Muninya Minya Jin or Nimran Semwa washisha fa mema and a mema down. Nemo munko fa nimbra akanoa a bebua mono and yejuma awa mwa manamanimo. If you want to separate God 
and your countries, you don't know what you bring on yourselves. Say, who per se, we in your coupon a free mamma a mine no more. Munim de Modibam also. Look at the nations who went on that tangent and compare them to the nations that respect God. There is a big difference. You will see that the people in the countries that respect God and serve Him wholeheartedly are blessed and wealthier than the people in the countries who don't respect God. She amanamania omufasa akwanso. Nefa want to to amanamansua wobu nyan kupon. Na obe huse. E nipa e wo amanamainua omubu nyan kupon. Wa ye isha na wa nya wa hun cheng e nipa wo wo amanamainua omubu nyan kupon. If you throw God away, it's like saying you don't want to live anymore. That is suicidal. Se utu nyanku pon echenia. Akwe te se di ewo kanse. Um pese ubet na sibiu. Enu di e ya confusion. How can you throw God who created you and the land on which you live away and succeed? Eh? How? Eh? Ebe de ne watu nyamia obo wu. Any assassin, I would so no action. Now, now we are here. Eh? A bad day. I'm saying it again. If you disagree with God and want to do your abominable things, do away with all his laws in your countries. When you gather as a country, don't pray. Don't drink water again. Don't breathe. And you will see where you will be. No one in this world can say that God is not in his daily dealings. Mesa Kabiu said, Uni nyame nyade, na upesa uye wa busu diya, mem fanimbra ni biya nyejuma, awo, wumayimu. Nese mushi ya se, omaya, mamu mompaye, mamu nomunsyo, mamu hume, na mbo hunu bebiya, mbo kwa koja. Obia ni wiasi ha obetu mi aka se ni daada de bi a oye no nyankopon nim If you see yourself as God so you can also enact your own laws it will be the laws of the tenant and the laws of the landlord as I told you last week and we shall see the one whose law will stand in the end so who say we ain't yami? I don't want to see you be to me as a umbra. I don't dare be quite quite a woman who ain't high dimbra. Any a few umbra, na every year no, ye be she die umbra a bejan. It is between your laws and God's laws, and you will see whether your law will prevail over God's law. That would never happen. A woomra, a ninyan cupomra. Now be who? Say umrano, and a bit dinyan cupon emraswa. Nano de intimi sita. If you see yourself as powerful to challenge God, don't die. Because God cannot die. Mm, yes. If you die, it implies that. You are only human being used and deceived by demons. So who who say who will to me now be to me in yamina chia and ye men who why a son sing yame on to me who they must a wood ya a such as a wee nipa da seni keka a damoni a council now a son so so that thou you are nothing. And you will meet the living God after your death. Un se she na ube siya nyamiti asifono e wu wu echi. What is an abomination is what demons 
want people who don't reason to do. The year busu di ano. I know na adamo ni pesa ni pa wamo njini yeno anye. It's all because such people don't know God, nor His wrath. Ni na sichre ni se. Some go for no mo ni miyami o. And no mo san susu ni ne bufushe. If you really know God and His wrath. When God says something is an abomination, you will never think of venturing to do it. Say, unim nyami pa, ena unim ne bufu shia. Say, o kase adibi e busudia, unji humpo na wabe hum se wukoye. If you take a stand against God and do it, you are telling God that. You don't respect his word. You don't fear him. And demons have taken away the repercussions of your thoughts and actions from your eyes. So, what is it? 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 What is a war wana montu no hu afri wani ase after judas became stubborn and betrayed the holy lord today judas's name has become an abomination wa bra judas esne ne kon na otietua na oyi ewrade kronkron ma ye no ene judas din no adani abusu de he disregarded the Lord's warning to do the abominable to be an abomination himself. What he did bounced back to him. What to a radical botany and okoye busudie, nema or no ankasa, a ye a busudie. The oye yeno, a samba or no anaso. Judas did that abomination because of money. And the same thing is happening in our generation. Sika, ene ma Judas ye sa abusu di eno. Nene, sa pepe pepe, ene koso wo ya wo onto ato aso imo. Today, demons are still pushing some people to take a contrary stand against God to do abominable things. And it's all because of the same motivation. Money. And nay, a damn money go so I can nipper be no muscle. A more gina gina be a beer tia yan coupon. Now I a busunema. Nanina ye at the cronoa a pimpy a Judas mokoye enobi. Sika croya. Money is causing a lot of people to do abominable things. Sika a pimpy a nipper I don't know whether it's because of ignorance or obstinacy or they haven't heard Judas's story. Minim se tu no matu koko bona chinu se omu kono masinu se Judas a semu susuna omunte danswa minim kra. People are also doing abominable things because of money, just like Judas. Enipa ye a busenema, a san sikenti, said ye Judas ye ye no pepe pepe pepe. And my questions are Haven't you heard Judas' story? And if you have, don't you know the repercussions of his actions? Eh? Na min sem bisane se. Ade on te Judas a sem no da na. Ne se wate ya. Ade un nim un sun suan soa. Nyo ye ye no ediba ya na. And if you claim that you haven't heard about Judas's betrayer of the Holy Lord. Which was an abomination. I am warning you that. You should never do anything 
that God says is an abomination in his sight. Because you can't stand his wrath. Hmm. They say, oh, Pastor, they say, Unti Judas yeo yi erade kronkono ma ya. Ne ye busu diye noa. E ne me bau koko. Se. Me nyadye biara nyanko ponsi. E ye e busu diye. E wo nene so. E san se. Un tu me nina ne bufu shiye na no da. As I told you last week. You live in God's earth. So it is his law. That you should obey and fear the most. Your national laws are only temporal. Said ye me can na ochi e chwe mono. Uti nyan kupon asasi so. Anunti ono nembra. E ne se se usuru pa. Mo mai nembra anu die. E du die uho e breti ya wabi. All of your laws shall pass away. But the word of God will remain forever. Hallelujah. Mumra ninya bechem nanyanku pombra no and a better order. So if you remain stubborn and want to take a contrary stand to do what God says human beings should not do, huh, you don't know what you bring on yourself. And nun tisa usri wokon nese udi uko jina bebiya. Upe se wu ya adia nyanku ponsi. Me ni pada seni nye nwa. U ni ma dia wu di ba wang kasa usu. Because of money, many people don't care of what they do. Si kenti, e ni pepe e nwini di omu ya hon. They behave as if there is no God and no one will judge them about their way of lives. Yeah. Omu ye omu ti se di yami biye ni ho. Na kwa ya omu fasu bo oma bra bonso no. Obiya muhu aten. Hmm? Don't let money influence you to endorse what God says it's an abomination. Me mesika en pie pie on. En ma unko fwa adia nyanko ponse. E ye busu di eno eso. It is very unfortunate eh, that because of the influence of money, many people have lost their senses of reasoning. Yes. It's very, very unfortunate. Very, very. And I want to say that something that they should not even think about, but just say, no, this is not right. Because of money, they will hesitate as if they don't know what to do. Adia, and say say what you know. No more can say. Debi 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 debi. Where the anya 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 kuranu. Sikanti, omu betun chen omu nasi na kwe ti se di omu nimni se se omu ye. Today, because of money, even preachers have also endorsed abominable things. And nay, a sign sikanti, and some paka fumbo. In the house of God, money can change what God says it's wrong to be right. Mm. It's serious. Oh. Very, very serious. Hey! When you are a young couple, you are a young couple. You are a young couple. You are a young couple. Hey! When some people see money, God's opinion about something does not matter anymore. Oh. Hey! Hmm. Se bino mou sika. A juni a nyan koupon wo. E fa a diye bi wono. A fe diye wun yye bi wou. Hey! In the house of God, when a rich man gives money to a greedy pastor, if even that rich man is having intimacy with the young girls in the church, the pastor wouldn't see anything wrong with what the rich man is doing. Hey! When you have a coupon for you, you can see the money, 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 you can see the money. Because of money, 
if a rich man in a church is a drug dealer, the pastor wouldn't see anything wrong with his dealings. It's a second thing. Say, second thing be wo a sorry mo. Next to town no bonia. Oso funi unu unfu so biya. I want to do my dear how dear no I Because of money, if a rich man in a church has three wives, a pastor will see nothing wrong with the polygamous lifestyle of the rich man. A son sikendi say sikeni bi wa sorry bi ne se ne yire nem kwa ya miensa o sofu ni hunu fum so biara e wo aware dudu abra bodo an o sikeni no e bono outside the church the haters of god are also using money to influence politicians to take a contrary stand against god's word Na ufri asori munsua. Womo omu ten ya meno. Omu disika e pien pien. E man yofo. E ma omu susu e jina jina biya. Omu ni nyanko pon beti. Hey. Because of money. What God says it's an abomination. Some politicians say it's not. E san sikanti. Die nyanko pon si e ye busu diya no. A man yofo bidu msi e ye busu diya. Hey. Money has brought a lot of abomination in God's sight. Sika edie busu die pi abanyanko po eniasi. That was why Apostle Paul admonished young Timothy to do away with the love of money because it is the root of all the evil done in this world. And unti na osmafu Paul to a branti Timothy for say. On to Sikado and Chini. A son said, Sikado no, and no ni bonia, ye yen wo viasi enna enhini. Judas was motivated by money, but later he realized what he did and threw the money away because he saw the dire consequences. Sika ne pia pia Judas, emo oko yedi o yedi. Nan so chire yinu, wa bro hun ni oye yinu, o kotu si kanigwe, e san se, o hun si sa so ke si e pa da e di beba. When Judas realized that, he couldn't answer for what he did, he came to his senses that, the money he received, from those who hated the Lord Jesus Christ, couldn't help him, in what he will face, after his death. Wabre Judas e hun se. On to me nyi anon wadi e oye e no e hun ti no. Neni ba ne hon so. E ma wo hun se. Sika no a o jifri wo mo a o mo tan e radi Yesu Christo hon no. En ti me mo hano. E wadi o beko ako shia e wo ni uwe chi. That was why he threw the money away. E nun ti no tu skadu go ye no. I am warning you. What is going to happen one day on this earth? You will throw all your money away and cry for help like Judas. Me country will say, a debi ba e wo viasi ha. A seme betu no. U betu si ke inegu. No wo supa pe moa. It is a Judas. If you love money and do the abominable, you will regret one day. Se udo sika, na uye busu diya. E debi ba, ube nuhu. When you stand before God, the money you used foul means to get, to do the abominable things, can't help you. Se, ujina nyamye ni mwa. Sika, ufa kwa mboni su nyaye, e diye sa e busu diya no, enti be mwa wu. When the veil was taken off from Judas' eyes, he had the ability to see things clearly. Wabra ye yi in kateni munu e free Judas e ni munu. A fede o nya di ene be mane tume di e hunu a di e yi. But it was too late. He had already done the abomination. 
enso so na kechre na waye ebusudi ene wie do you want money to let you do the abominable do you want money to send you to hell but it will be too late to repent do you want to soil your own reputation because of money do you want your name to be mentioned with a pinch of salt because of money do you want god to see you as an abomination because of money o pese sika e ma o ye ebusodi ana o pese sika e de ko obonsam jemu ana sikenti o pese wan kasa o se udin ana e se sikenti e de o pese se e bo udin and go for who would you say at Tantadia be no boom for an hour? And do persist, Kenti, Yankupon, who say we are Busudiana. A word to the wise is enough. O Banyan Seni, ye bunu bet, Nayan Kanasen. Another abomination that demons push some people to do. Is incest. A busudie biwa a damoni pien pien nipa a mo mu ye a ye o beat ni or no ankasa ne busye ni ana or no ani moja eda. That is having sexual intimacy with your blood related person, like mother and son, father and daughter, or brother and a sister. That is an abomination before God. I know any say only one casa ubusieni or ye umoja eda. It is say a be a mami be any ne baba ma eda. Ana se a jebi any ne baba eda. Ana se be me be ni ni nua ba eda. A ye busudi e kwa e wonyami eni so. God has said in His word that. No one should do that. Nyamia kawona se muse memo bia and yesa. But because demons want such people to do abominable things and be seriously cursed, that is what they are pushing some people to do. Nansu su san se Adam money pese binum ye a busu dienti o pien pia binum e momo yesa. Today, some fathers have intimacy with their daughters. Some mothers have intimacy with their sons. And some brothers have intimacy with their sisters. In fact, the world is heading towards a dangerous end. No cranny, baby, we are sick or no, and you crow. Hey, many people have ignored God's warnings and are doing things that will bring generational curses on their bloodlines. Any peppy at to your coupon cock or bargaining and a warm way and near man. A dear one to a to a swan no me a beba or mojan. And that was what Lot did with his two daughters. Nasana Lot and then a mamma me no aye. Lot had intimacy with his two daughters and produced two sons with them. It was serious. Oh. Serious. Lot and then a mamma me no a die. Those two boys were Moab and Benami. Sa mamema mienu no na wamu ye Moab ene Benami. So, how will Lord call those boys? Will he call Moab my son or my grandson, or Benami my son or my grandson? Eh? Saying a lot, a be fresa a memano. Say Moab me ba anami nana. 
Ana se benami me ba ana me nana. If Lot called Moab and Benami his sons, then they will ask, Papa, did you sleep with your own daughters who are our mothers to produce us? Say Lot to Fre Moab any Benami say the money we made ya. On baby son say, Hey, inti Papa, are the only wa o mama no a o mu ye ye mama no ene wo ye ya na. And if Lot called them his grandsons, they will also ask, Where are our fathers? And I say, Lot to so fra or mo se, wo mo ye ni nana no mo, wo mo baby sa se, eni na ye papa no mo ye. You see the confusion I'm talking about? That abominable people don't think about? Wo mo saka saka ye no, me ka hua se mo, People who do abominable things bring confusion into this world. When people decide to go against the natural ordinances of God, they bring confusion into the society. Dr. Kukudazi said that. Let me repeat. When people decide to go against the natural ordinances of God, they bring confusion into the society. Se ni pa ye wan jun se, di e nyan kupon ashisheno, ombe sorye tia, ombe di saka saka ye, e batima mufuomu. Misi subiyo, misi se ni pa ye wan jun se, Obe kwenye tia nyanku ponchi shaya. Omo di saka saka ye. E ba tima mfumu. Dr. Kuku da zinekaye. If God says a man should marry a woman. And you say a man should marry a man. You bring confusion into this world. Si nyanku ponchi. Be ma wari oba. Nese wonsu si. Be ma timi wari be ma. If God created you as a man and you want to do an operation to be a woman, you bring confusion into this world and into the washroom. Hmm. Hmm. Because the women are confused whether they should see you as a man or a woman. A son said, A man, a name of a no moon, say, Who saw we a bemo, saw we a bow. When God says you should not have sexual intimacy with any of your family people, and you do that. You bring confusion into your family and into the society because you confuse the children that are produced from your abominable act. Senyan kupon kase men ni wan kasa umuja ana obusu ni na nese uni omu koda nese mu wun koda udi saka saka ye eba wabusu ya num eniti mamufumu esan sen koda yebe wun free sa wabusu diye no mono uma niye ma bofra uma jen you see the confusion demons want to push people to bring into this earth for God's wrath to be released have you seen it wawu mm-hmm. saka saka ya adamo ni pesu upie pie ni pe binum ema wadi ba asasi so se di ebe nyanko pon ebe sani ne bufu shiana wawu if you are a father and you want to have intimacy with your own daughter because of demonic ritualistic purposes for money, don't you know that you are destroying your own daughter bodily, mentally, and spiritually? So we are ja. Nese o pese o ni wanka sa o ba e da. E sa a da moni e mu siyo e ni wan nu mi ni e ma e di pese kentia. Who say one cassano? Who say wow, Babano? 
ewo ni ni pedu mu hunhun mu ani na jere mu and when you produce children with your own daughter as i talked about the incident of lot how will you call such children eh ne se woni wan kasa o baba no edawo a se de me di lot asem no eye mfato ho no san koda no wo be fra o say and you as a daughter if you do the abominable by agreeing to have intimacy with your own father don't you know that you are also bringing a curse on yourself na won so o ba no a wo be pene so say woni wan kasa o papa e na na munye busu de no wo nim say wo de no me say o bre wan kasa o and you also the son who also agrees to have intimacy with your own biological mother don't you know that you are also bringing a curse on yourself na won so so be ma no a wa prince wa woni wan kasa o mami o wo wo da no wo nim say wo de no me e ba wan kasa o so people commit these abominable acts because of three reasons eni pa ye sa e busudie e sa nyina so me ensanti one it's because of money because some people want money at all cost when demons instruct them to do stupid things they oblige it's very sad eh the edikan e sikanti e san se e kon bia so enipa binum e pesikanti sa da money e kan won so se won mo yen kwasiade a won mo pere so it's because of demonic ritualistic purposes for money that is why some people shamelessly have intimacy with their own mothers and some mothers also have intimacy with their own sons and some fathers also have intimacy with their own daughters it's very very sad a son adamoni amusuade ya odi peskenti anu nti na mema bi ani wu asem a omoni wo mo ankasa mame da na mame no bi nsoso ani wo mo ankasa mame ma eda na ejanu mo nsoso bi no mo nso ani wo mo ankasa mama nsoso eda no two they do that because of power they tosu me no to me nti ani bi no yesa demons tell such people that when you have intimacy with your own blood you will have power hey adam one catch this anko for this say say woni wan kasa wo moja da wo benya to me hey that is why some people have intimacy with their own mothers or their virgin daughters and don't in a binum any woman kasa mame eda ana say wo mo mamba nso a wo ye emaburo no eda no if you want to have power the word power is with my god hallelujah Amen. he gives it free of charge god has given me power Amen. and i didn't do any abominable thing se o petumi a eye mawurade onko ane wo o di maye nko a nyame ama me to me pa na manye busudie bia as god's children as we live a holy life fast and pray we are empowered by the holy spirit say ye nyankopon emai wa bra ye bo abra bo kronkron na ye ya kom chini e bo mpaye no nyame hu kronkron maye to me number 3 they do that because of lust they toso me sa a corner and a mom yes sir because of lust some fathers and mothers don't care to have intimacy with their own daughters or sons it's a corner ti e janum bi emfa ho se ono ono ani baba beda e na mami bi susu mfa ho se oni ono ankasa ni baba e man susu e beda because of lust they don't care to destroy their own daughters or sons akononti 
omu mfa huse, omu bese, omu ankasa mamba anu, anase, omu mame manu. And the daughters, who are normally used by their fathers, live with a shame that they can't disclose. Oh. It's very sad, eh? Nasa, emanua, omu papano, eya omu sanu. Na eniwo asha omu ma, omu ntu minka huasem. Eya rehupa. So, because of money, demonic power, and last, many people do abominable things. Na chese, isa nsika, adamu ni tumi, eni akononti. When Lot did that, listen to what happened to his own family afterwards. Wabra Lot yesan ti die tu ono ankasa na busu anachiri. I want to remind you that Lot was Abraham's nephew, so Lot and Abraham were from the same family, but they were separated. Me pese me kai wo se, Lot, na wo ye Abraham wo fasi. Eti no mo yine fre busi ya kronu mo, o na wo mo mo eti te ye. But when God multiplied Abraham, as the nation of Israel, and they were advancing towards the promised land, God told Israel, in Numbers chapter 25, that they shouldn't have anything to do with the people of Moab. Because they were a case. Oh! Nansusu, wabra, inyami, eshira, Abraham, no ma na sidor ya, omu bedani ye, Israel maeno, na woko e, ni ma kofa boshe asasin. Nyanku pon katre Israel fo, e wo numre ngomano, ti e diyonu numse. Ma omu ni moab, e nyashi, e nye, e sanse, Na womuye enome. You see what I'm talking about? Because of what Lord did, the children he produced with his own daughters became a curse. And God didn't want their own distant cousins to have anything to do with them. One one sema maker. A son the Lord yeah yeah. Or no no one kasane mama a wu yentino. A man or a woman, a bear, a nome. Nanya men pese, woman cassa, a bushing of war, or me is Rafono, and the one benya track and be That is why I am admonishing you that you should never do anything that is an abomination in God's sight. And until I meet two for say, men ya dear biara, a ye busudier, a winyame, and this. You see, the people Israel should have seen as distant relatives were seen as curses because of the abomination of Lot. That is the generational curse. I want you to see if you want to do anything that God says it's an abomination. And no ne I want to at us one no menu me pese uno. Se o pese o ya die biara nyanko ponse e ye busodia. So if you are a woman, don't let your demonic father use you to do his abominable thing to have money. And it is all your ba. Mema o papa da money a shene manu em fawo nye busudie em peska. Whatever he gives you, he will enjoy his riches and die and go to hell. But it is you who will live with the shame and spiritual stigma for the rest of your life. Di odibe ma u biya anu, onu neni be jini sika na hon, na we uwa kobo sam jem. Nesu su wudye, wudye ni uwo no, any sunsumu and cano a becauso or unkwana. I have prayed for some women 
who went through such a painful ordeal. Ma bompaya ma mabia omoko sa tibia e yai emubi. It's very sad. I feel very, very sad for such women. When it happens like that, they become quite secretive and some even fear men and don't want to marry. And if even they are married, they don't enjoy their marriages. Say, Ebasa, na masama na edin, na omwa nipa. Omu ka omu nsemwa, omu di niye mesi. Na, ama omu suru mema. Na, ebi kura mpese, omu beware. Ne se binsu su kura aware ya. Omu eni nje aware ya omu omu no. Why is it so? It's because of being used to do abominable things. Adenti ene mani basa. Ni ina ane se, ye di omu aye ebusu diye. And if you are a father and you do this to your own daughter, don't you see that you are a very wicked and a selfish person? Eh? They say, We are a jack. No one can say, We are a baba. Say, If you who say, We are a nipa, we are a dimpa, we are a person. You see, demons are pushing people to do these abominable things because of their bad money and such weak people don't see the repercussions of the actions one more it's a adam on a sick a bunny ninti and i will pimp your nipper binum a mom yes a busu day now so so on who and since i saw a war one i'm on to know as moab and benami became curses because of what lord did if you use your daughters for demonic ritual money, your daughters will become a curse. It's very sad, eh? Very, very sad. The year, Moab, any Ben Nami, a Bayer Nome, a Sunday lot, a year in Tino. So do Mama, a cope, a damn Moja Sikano, woman so so, a Baba Bayer, a Nome, a Rehopa. And are you happy that? You will become rich, but your children and your grandchildren and your great grandchildren become a curse. Mm -hmm. Are you happy about that? Eh? Now, in the when you jihun say, "Udi e wo nyeska," then so so ma, unana num, any unana na na num abeye eno me ana. When you jihun sa, be wise. And don't do anything abominable in God's sight. Because your action will affect your name. And also bring a generational curse in your bloodline in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Na sansu so di a wan tu a tu a so no me a ba wan ka sa omo janu. E wo yesu di inti. Amen. If you are wise and you want to escape God's wrath and you don't want to live to do anything abominable, give your life to the Lord Jesus Christ by praying this prayer with me. So we e nyan se ni Na o pese o jani nyanko pa un e bufu shiye. Na o mpese o be transi a ye a die biara a ye busu diya. Fa homa e radi Yesu Christo. Wa bra o ne mi bosa ampa ye. Lord Jesus. E radi Yesu. I thank you for speaking to me today. Me da wa se. So wa kasa che me ne. I accept that I am a sinner. Mi jitum se mi ye di bon ye ni. But from this day forward. Nen so e fri neri kri. I believe in my heart. And confess with my mouth that Jesus, you are the only Lord. Forgive me of all my sins. And write my name in the book of life. Let your Holy Spirit dwell in me. 
And I will live a holy life to please you. Thank you for saving me. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Father, thank you for speaking to people, for them to realize how dangerous it is to be urged on by demons to do abominable things so that they will run to you and live holy to please you in Jesus name amen 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 a action power of faith ministries, Reverend Dr. Kukudazi Efrib, and a Okasa Ewo AP Radio, so 105.7. Ebi and our person will say T and Semi Mubu. Now, Utina said, Jenny Jenna, Wukwada, Ni Fiada, and you men on soon be a obey to me as I eat ye the view. Now, so who should share your child crying? Now, person will need a best summer. Ye war. Holy Land, Holy Land, you know, a war. Kumasi Kasi, Kasi Main Road, we can say, Abatwa, no, a war on Sabin Kumusua. We need fast some feeling stations in between two or so. The other kind, the other some, you know, the other some, you know, no quite than in shame with Sanico form. Fasa quite no so I could see from China and could be a beer beam. We can Holy Land, no, a war. And that question down or pay a sum a year, no crown. Ukuada and you mean on the fan a Bible addition, and if you had that and you mean on the fan a year and Pibo, then a papa can say, Mamma, me real crow out. A son said, Em, demon sonno, and him said, Ni pay Jimmy, and see, oh, Mamma, ni pay ye at the bonina and the shame me before now. No one more demon secure ya, ma quiet be dead in Panama, no a cool, no one more quitting in yammy and him. Ye do my tree, Jim. Nimpansu, ring young son, say. Mra, yammy, I shall say, and yen. Mammy, ye, a son, say, me, and Cassa, many, and Bri say. Sam, run away, yan, and me, and the bay, age man. Me, me, yen, yammy, met to me, a woo. A home, you could tell me, and yammy, dear. A from a family home, and yammy, dear. And now, soon, yammy, dear. In tin yammy, and she said, na say, china, who be free, we are O ti awo home no anu anu no ni pe hunu se nyansa ne se mi a mi ku ati nyame no me mi nya nyame mi ni me kwa da aka enti ma mi fe suro ni awo bopo eni nyame mra nsama chi na reho sam kura san ye ma reho ni wo mu aye pe ye sika na ye di ehu ajonjon occult bi ana ku boni bi mu na omo ye echi wade a ebo man eti nyame e wo asase so Nyami abone mai no hu. Nu waka sasa niye ma uwe bichi. Na wwa ni pada seni wusu wichiri bibi. Na so baba na siye di saadi ya na yedri ya niyama uwe dia. Ubu ufu. Mi fana se. Eje bi ufiye. Nu wa se me. Me mi prekunam. Na wwa baba na uwe yine no uma di prekunama ye unkwenye si uwa. E di asam na abeka. Uwa uwe ye kura uwe e di awarija ye beba. Na wu eja na se e na anaba. What do you want to do a group of bean tea? Yes, say no, mamma, na. Oh, papa, na. And now, papa, ne banna. And then, yan in yanna, because of Sikabia woo be yan tea. Miss Awa, I woo yes, I say. So, papa, do you bear yassi? And now, mammy, or do you bear yassi? Or ya was sunk a bay all day. What when yinny are we a papa? What who pessica did tea? Yes, say no, banna. Now, what penis so by a side, dear man? Sell cows who papa, you will be sunk a bay all day. Mo say mo ma, mo say mo generation, ne de no me any afra fra abba sa si so. Amma, e chi wadi abo ma yi, e jira ho, e ti em, e fre radi. Na ma anshe ya, e di nyami abu fisi yo be mo me yi na so. Da nyami sa ho pa, mi huwa sa ma me ka, e ya reho sempa, sa wye ba, ba. Na o papa ye o sa, e ya reho sempa, e fri witi mo da. Nyami sa ho, e wo ye su di mo. Amen. Amen, Mama. Onya, se wa manya menchendia. Adamo ni be kanswa mwaye busudye u. 
na wa ankasa akofa no me abra wo ene mo je nyina wate my dear if you don't run to my lord jesus christ demons will urge you on to do abominable things mm-hmm. to bring a generational curse on yourself and your bloodline mm-hmm. that is why i want you to give your life to the lord jesus christ mm-hmm. if you want power mm-hmm. that word only belongs to my lord yes. jesus christ he is the only one who has power amen so come to him and live a holy life and his power will protect you mm-hmm. He is able to set you free mm-hmm. from all demonic powers. Mm-hmm. That is why I always say that with God all, all things, things are possible. possible. God bless you. Bless you too. Oni atasani uyo hoho wa.